Today we're going to find out if Spider-Man can exist in the real world. I'm going to interview Mr. Sullivan, the chemistry teacher, to have his intake on the situation. Research spider silk and I found that it's very low in density, it's very lightweight, but it's also very strong. I do believe it's theoretically possible for there to be a real human Spider-Man. So I do think it's possible if there was some type of genetic engineering uh, whereby a human's DNA could be altered so the human would also produce the same type of proteins that spiders produce without thinking and we could actually have a real Spider-Man. Just as if there were real spiders with spider silk, they could actually be, in theory, uh, real Spider-Man. You know what it is I love about being Spider-Man? Everything. There you have it. The Amazing Spider-Man can exist in the real life, but only by genetic mutation. I'm Spider-Man.